Hey guys, welcome to this video. In this one, I'm just going to talk about Pepperstone. Um, they're a broker that I've used for a while and they're quite well uh, reviewed actually in the trading space. You can see on the home screen at the moment, it says spread betting on TradingView. Um, TradingView broker of the year, of course, I post on TradingView a lot. Um, I'm top streamer and poster on there. Um, with uh, pretty much daily analysis across various assets. Of course, if you want to get my free training, guys, don't forget to grab it underneath. And if you can press the like and subscribe, you'll see my new videos. So Pepperstone, the layout, fairly ideal. Um, they offer various different platforms, which we'll go through. The main thing to note is that they've got their nice disclaimer at the top there. And also, if you go to the bottom, they've got their disclaimer down here, as well as their FCA regulation. So really, when you're using a broker, you want to make sure that they're regulated. I like using Pepperstone because I know um, they've got an office in London. Obviously, I'm in, I'm in England, not too far from London. So um, it's quite ideal. Now, like I said, they've got various rewards, ADVFN, FX Scouts, uh, TradingView, like I said, broker of the year. So a lot of good um, reviews there. And they offer... TradingView integration, which is very popular at the moment. Lots of people are using that. Many of my academy members indeed use TradingView integration and integrate their broker with, um, with TradingView uh, via these um, brokers like Pepperstone, etc., 8CAP, ones I reviewed before. Uh, they let you use CTrader, which some people use, but mostly MT4 is what I use and suggest. So quite standard there, MT4, MT5, TradingView good tools to be able to use. So that's one uh, checkbox ticked. Now, the reason why I use Pepstone is because of their spreads. Um, they're, they're really quite reliable, to be honest. If you look, for example, at the UK 100, which I trade a lot, the spread is one point, okay? And it varies for FX pairs. You can see it's changing, but generally it's quite low. If you look at gold as well, quite low there too. So things people like trading a lot, Tesla, um, you've got quite low spread, which is really, really ideal. So another tick on the box is that the spreads are tight. That's what you really want um, with Pepperstone. And I think that's reflective of their reviews and um, uh, being the top broker. It's just because they're so popular. And of course, uh, those spreads are very much preferred. If you're in the UK as well, it's important to know, like myself, I spread bet um, a lot and I do it because it's tax free. I mean, why wouldn't you? Um, the government essentially thinks it's gambling. <laughs> more or less um but yeah tax free if you want to spread bit in the uk so they are quite fast i can say in my experience that my orders rarely are delayed and actually compared to several other brokers which i've used before they're actually a lot quicker which is really good they're regulated which i said as well which is exactly what you need they've also got razor sharp spreads like we were saying um with uh but the only difference here is it would be for a razor account so 1,200 plus instruments as well is an awful lot. That's more than various other brokers. So not only have you got really tight spreads, you've also got loads and loads of different um, available instruments. Now they'll tell you all about those and the different ones you can trade, but just know if you've got 1,200 plus, it's very likely you can trade pretty much anything you want to trade with a broker. Um, so I wouldn't worry about being limited in that sense. And if you're someone who likes to trade things very abstract or very different, very exotic, or perhaps some stock you're after, uh, you can probably search it on here and find out. I mean, it does say uh, a little bit about that. And it also says um, right here, available stock. So you can check for each jurisdiction. You can click um, the link and it will take you to find that out. They offer a little bit in the way of education, um, analysis, the platforms we've gone over as well, the markets, and they offer CFD accounts and spread betting accounts, which again is quite standard across the board. So if you want to read further about their pricing, their spreads, commissions and swaps, things like that, it depends what type of account and how you're trading um, generally. Um, and in regards to funding and withdrawals, I don't get charged for those either, which is, which is quite good. They also offer professional accounts um, and like I said, various different types of trading accounts. So you can also go on here and read um, you know, there's, there's, you've got your standard or your razor. It really just depends on the way you trade as to which type of CFD trading account you get um, or or if you choose a spread betting account. So you can read all of this and have a little play around, but generally my review overall, Pepperstone are very reliable. 
and I would definitely suggest using them. And um, they've got quite tight spreads as well. They're fully regulated, which is exactly what, what we want to see. But of course, make sure you read the disclaimers up here at the top in the description and underneath and stay tuned. If you want my free training, it's underneath the video. See you in the next one, guys.